Hello and welcome to Scottish Car Enthusiasts and Trains TV and to part 8 of our Bring Back Max Power series where we are continuing to look at the May 2002 edition of Max Power magazine. So why are we bringing back Max Power? Well it's quite simple, on the 23rd of July 2023 we'll be heading to the Max Power reunion show at the Staffordshire County Showground in Stafford. Um, so what can you expect to see at the Max Power Reunion Show? You can expect to see um, DJ Richie Don, Jamie Shaw from Charisma, Max Power Era Cars, and Peugeot Acosta bringing at least 15 of their um, cars that they built um, for the Max Power scene. So if you're free or want to exhibit, then why not check out the Max Power Reunion page um, and follow the links to uh, buy tickets to exhibit your car, um, come as a spectator and buy some Max Power Reunion merchandise. So without much further ado, let's get into part 8 of Bring Back Max Power. So we kick off with a double page spread for um, Max Power um, Maxed Text, where you can get chatting, you can get uh, Olivia's voicemail, you can wind up your mates, or you could do some direct dating. So chat up the chicks, text over Max Heads and wind up your mates. It's all good and it's all waiting for you at maxpower.co.uk or call the numbers below. So we're just going to move on to our next page. And this is um, the good and the bad. So this is um, Ahmed, Ahmed Holmes pumping Calibra is up for a saucy scene too by the super sexy and style conscious devil and angel. Then we have an advert for Autosport um, based in Bolton. So again, you have some um, TSW wheels, BMW Mercedes replica wheels, Momo Arrows, um, wheel freeze. And then you have all body kits for your BMW E36 Illusion kit, Citroen AX, Fiat Bravo Indy kit, Fiat Punto Diablo kit, and your Ford Escort Cosy kit for your if you wanted to have a cosy replica, um, let's see what else I've got. Um, Peugeot 106 Mirage kit, Laguna Street Fighter kit, Toyota Yaris, Astra Mark IV Corsa Combat kit. We just continued to look at Ahmed's uh, Calibra, and this is how Max Power have improved it, how it could have been. So let's move on to the next page. Then we have some Max Power accessories um, from Cosmos, world trend setters apparently. So you've got some seat covers, um, window winders, handbrake handles, gear gaiters, tax disc holders, pedal kit, gear shift gaiter. Uh, and these were available from places like Motor World, Spares World, TMC, and Autosave. Then moving on, we've got the Ministry of Testing. So we've got a G-Force meter here. The max power rated that as 9. Then we have some League 081 alloys that are on one of the staffer's cars. And they don't seem to have kept... Uh, Lasted very well, but uh, without becoming seriously corroded. Not even 12 months. Then you've got the Progo, professional Pogo stick. Then you have a spanner kit from King Dick. Then we have Evil, based in Peter Lee. 
So again, specialists in um, BSA alloys, um, TSW wheel race, Momo, then you've got your suspension kits, Type R, Evo Type R springs, uh, tires, Sportex exhausts. Before moving on to the next part of the testing, which is this Jedisi Plus uh, a reader detector. Yep, it picks up all the speed cameras and max power rated is 8. Then you have the new uh, Air Ride at Alton Towers. I got 7. Then we've got Halford's Rapid Digital Tire Inflator. Uh, max power, a bit dubious about testing Halford's Rapid Digital Tire Inflator. But apparently Halford's got it spot on. And that got a rating of 9 out of 10. And then you've got some some Swarfiga wipes for when you get your hands dirty working on the car. When they were testing the wipes to see how clean they could get their hands. And that was rated 5. Next up, we have an advert for New Image Car Hi-Fi Limited, or .com. Um, so if you were in the market for Sony, um, Kenwood, Pioneer, um, Rockford Fosgate, um, Ultramit Superb New US Manufactured Products, Audiovisual Products, um, Packages like your sub and an amp, um, sub and amp combination ring for the best prices. You could get yourself a JBL sub pack 10 for £190, which included a loud and clear amp, uh, ported box, and amp wiring kit. So we'll just move on to the next page. And then we've got the car audio centre. Who are specialists in Kenwood and Sony? So, again, offering sub deals as well. So, you could get yourself a 20 inch base pack, uh, uh, 2 KFC W2503, 10 inch uh, subs, a uh, box, and the legacy 500 watt amp. Then if we move on, you've got your Sony Car Audio Center, as I said, the specialist in Sony as well. And you could get yourself, let's have a look at this deal here. An XSA W200X 8 inch amplifier sub box for £150. So if you just wanted to sub an amp built in together, then this was probably a good choice to take, save a wee bit of space in the boot. Then we've got some Pioneer deals. So let's have a look at this. Um, seven inch um, motorized in dash screen. That's the AVX P7300 DVD. And just look at how much these things were back in the day. £1,000. Then we've got Kenwood and Sony Legacy. Then we've got um, an advert for Mobile World, In-Car and Security. Um, again, Kenwood, Sony, Mobile Media, CD packages, cassette players. You could, you could also get yourself a, a great looking cassette player um, for £150 back in the day. Speakers. CD packages, radio cassette, compact disc, mini disc. Again, still got some here. So you've got your Kenwood amplifiers, Alpine amps, Rockford Fosgate, Pioneer. 
there's another deal for a GL audio. This one here. So you got a 12 inch 400 watt amp, 400 watts, or 10 inch sub, and custom made carpeted box for 119 pounds. Before moving on to the Ultramet head guide, what's out there and how much do each one cost? It's all here. So we're going to pick a few um, uprated in-car entertainment for your pleasure back in 2002. And the first one we're going to look at is the Orlando CD70. Price is £290. It's got four uh, 45 watt um, speakers, two pre-outs or two, it's multi-changer compatible and it plays CD. That's from Bloypoint. And we're going to have a look at next this Kenwood here. This is a Kenwood um, Z838W. Price is £500. It's got 4x50 watts, got free pre outs, multi changer compatible, plays CD, CD rewritable, MP3, and WMA. Let's have a look at what we can look at now. Next up we have a Pioneer DEH P9400MP. Price £750. It's got 4x50 watts. It's got free pre-outs. It's multi-changer compatible. It plays CD, CD rewritable. MP3 WMA and its special feature is a programmable display. Let's go for a Rockford Fosgate here. So this is a Rockford Fosgate RFX 9210. Price is £480. 4x30 watts. It's got three pre-outs. Multi-changer compatible, no. Play CD, CD rewritable and MP3. How about a Fusion FCD 220M? £430. It's got 4 by 45 watts, it's got three pre-outs, it's multi-changer compatible and it plays CD, CD rewritable and MP3. Next up, we have an advert for the Nintendo GameCube in the UK's only official magazine, which is the Nintendo Official Magazine. Let's have a look at this Alpine here. This is the Alpine CDA 7998R. £800 it cost. Power is not applicable. Pre-outs is free. You can use a multi-changer. And it plays CD, rewritable, and MP3. Now, next up, Maxper, I've just given you a guide to um, what does what. So you've got a bit of back of stereo, you've got your aerial, you've got your bus cable, pre outs, battery memory lead, uh, ISO plug, cage. Rubber bolt, uh, internal amplifier, ACC lead, telephone mute, remote lead, fascia panel, display, single DIN, and keys. So that's just a look at some um, stereos. Um, I think what we'll do is we'll just finish on this part for part eight of 
bring back max power. We'll be back over the course of the next week at some point, um, as we'll be as there'll be a few videos of the Furious Drive and Social down at the Motorist in Sherburne and Elmet. At the weekend, we're going down on Sunday, and we're also having a walk walk round review of a car while we're down there as well. So there'll be a few videos going out potentially next week of the motorist um, the furious driving social at the motorist but for a moment i'd just like to thank you for watching and um, don't forget to like and subscribe at scottish car enthusiasts and trains tv and i'll catch you in a future video very soon farewell <laughs>